Hello, faith leaders, and welcome to break time. Today we are in Psalm 912, and it says this, For he who avenges blood remembers. He does not ignore the cries of the afflicted. Have you ever honestly felt like God was ignoring your what's going on around you, that he, that he just absolutely forgot about you? You've been troubled in some way, you've been hurt in some way, you've been persecuted in some way, and but yet, you know, God, you don't sense that God is doing his thing and what he's supposed to be doing. But we have to remember when I, when I go through times of persecution, when I sense that God isn't seeing, that he sees, he, his eyes are among me. He doesn't ever ignore me. Now, see, for some of us, you know, we may have been ignored by, you know, in our childhood or some other way. So we carry that with us into this relationship with God. And we think sometimes that God, we're not either worthy. There's something sometimes that's in us that says, God isn't paying any attention to me. And oftentimes it may be because there's a root there that, you know, you're, you have this big fear of rejection. So you don't want to go to God because you don't want that to, to sense that he's ignoring you. But whatever it may be, know this, know these things for certain. God is not going to ignore you. But what he is going to do is he has his best interest, your best interest in his heart and in his ways. And you know, he doesn't, he doesn't act at often at times the way that we think he should. Because his perspective is so much different than ours. Ours is right here for today, you know, but God is an eternal God. He sees the eternal perspective. And also, if you know, those that you've been troubled or persecuted by, he sees their heart. He knows their intent. He knows all. He sees all. So walk in your day as if you know that God is seeing you and what is going on around you. You you don't have to ever have in anything the enemy the, any seed any untruth that the enemy might try to throw your way that God isn't paying attention to you. He is, but it may not feel like it. But God does not ignore your cry, and especially that cry that is hurt. You know He sees it. He understands, but His ways are so much higher. God does not ignore you. He loves and adores you.